tell me about this outfit. Uh, well, this is a little bit of a mixture of both of our styles. Right. We decided very late into the game, we were like, oh, you need something. We don't want a tie, we don't want a bow tie, so we settled on bolo tie. And you know, I think we're bringing it back, ladies and gentlemen. How'd you take this thing off, just for the people at home? Oh, this? Yeah. It doesn't come off. Now that it's on, it's on for good. See, that's the catch. That's the catch. So you're going to sleep in this. Okay, I'm, I'm going to a wrong place right now. <laughs> what brings you out tonight? Uh, David Hart. Also, I'm interested in seeing who wins tonight. Come on, let's be real. Do you love fashion? I do. I love avenues of fashion. I wouldn't say that I love it all. And uh, I have a love-hate relationship with it, as most people do. I'm just a real Which hate? Which hate? First off, I love in New York City, particularly, yeah. people are being creative and expressing themselves in avenues that are very physical. For me, coming from California, which was just essentially skate rat culture yeah. in the valley, this was a very new thing for me. So seeing it here and seeing it start from kind of, I don't know, street level, rising upward and seeing how people are inspired by it and then building a, building a whole brand around it is cool. I like that. Is there anyone in the fashion industry who you, uh, you, you see as an icon for you or someone who you'd really like to meet at an event like this tonight? Uh, you know, I will say that I've been lucky enough to meet a lot of the people that I was looking forward to in terms of names. But in terms of my inspirations, I find that it's actually a lot of the times just old men on trains. Uh, L Train has some very interesting old men style. And uh, it's been very inspiring. As you can see, I take a little bit with me. Et voilà.